When galaxies collide, it's not a cosmic explosion. It's a slow, gravitational dance that can last millions of years. At the heart of each galaxy lies a supermassive black hole, containing millions, sometimes billions, of solar masses. So, when two galaxies merge, their central black holes should eventually find each other and begin orbiting a shared center of gravity, forming one of the universe's most extreme systems, a supermassive black hole binary. But here's the mystery. After decades of searching, we've never actually seen one. A new review, led by Martin G. H. Krauss, brings together clues from across the electromagnetic spectrum to track these hidden cosmic beasts. According to theory, after a galactic merger, each black hole sinks toward the center of the new galaxy, slowed by what S called dynamical friction. They spiral closer and closer, from thousands of light years apart to just a few. As they orbit, gas falling onto them should produce double-peaked emission lines, and if one black hole launches a jet, its orbital motion could make that jet wobble or twist into an S-shape, a clear sign of a binary system. Radio telescopes like LOFAR have already spotted galaxies showing exactly those strange, curved jet structures. Some systems, called dual active galactic nuclei, even seem to show both black holes feeding on gas at once, glowing like twin cosmic engines. If confirmed, these binaries would be a goldmine for gravitational wave astronomy. Unlike the brief, high-pitched signals detected by LIGO, supermassive black hole pairs emit slow, deep waves that ripple across the universe for millions of years, waves that future missions like LISA could detect. But there's still one huge question, the final parsec problem. How do two giant black holes get from a few light years apart down to the point where they actually merge? We might need the help of gas clouds, nearby stars, or maybe even a third black hole to finish the job. Until we find one, the hunt for monster black hole pairs continues. And when we finally spot them, it'll rewrite what we know about the violent history of galaxies and the universe itself.